In this video tutorial, we're going to go ahead and cover how to create a survey with WP Courseware. Okay, let's get started. The first thing we need to do is we need to go ahead and add a course unit. So under course units, we're going to click add new. We're going to go ahead and give our course unit a name. And if you wanted to provide some sort of content prior to the survey, you could add that here. You could actually add text or photos or multimedia hyperlinks and things of that nature. And we're going to go ahead and click publish. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and click training courses, add quiz or survey. And here we're going to go ahead and give our quiz a title. And next what we want to do is select the quiz type. And the quiz type for the survey is survey mode. And we just simply need to select save quiz settings. And now we want to go ahead and add questions. I'm going to go ahead and start off with a true or false question. And I'm going to go ahead and add in a multiple choice. And I'm going to go ahead and add one more multiple choice question. Now I'm going to get to show you a really cool feature here. We can actually add additional answers for a multiple choice question. And we're going to go ahead and click Save Questions. Okay, now we've got our survey completed. So now what we need to do is we need to assign the unit and the quiz to a module. And so we're going to go click Training Courses. We're going to go ahead and click Modules, Units, and Quiz Ordering for the associated course, which is WP Courseware. And if we scroll down to the very bottom, I'm going to go ahead and add this unit in at the very, very end here. And I'm going to go ahead and add our survey to the unit. And I'm going to click Save Changes to Ordering. Okay, so now we have our survey completed. And so what we need to do now is actually go and complete our course so we can take our survey. So back at our course, I'm going to go ahead and truck on through the last two units here. And now we have our survey. Again, we have the content area here where you can add additional content. Uh, now we go ahead and just truck through these. Of course, there's no right or wrong answers. So if you remember when we set up these questions, uh, we did not have an option to select the correct answer because there is no correct answer for a survey. So let's go ahead and just truck through these. I think I say true. Uh, I like video and obviously my course is a 10. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and submit our answers. And that's basically it with the survey. Uh, there's nothing else to do with the survey. Obviously, it is a survey. So now what we want to do is we want to go back to our admin panel. And we want to go up into users. And we want to see what's going on with this final quiz. If you notice, user one, which is me, I finished WP Courseware 100%. And what I'm going to do is click View Detailed Progress. And we're going to scroll down under the WP Courseware course. And you'll notice here under the quiz status for the survey, it just says completed uh, because it is just a survey. But we want to look at the details. And let's find out what the answers were here. So now you've got the three questions, and it gives you the three exact answers that I provided. Uh, so again, you know, these, these are just surveys to help you maybe rate your course, gauge content, and obviously there's no right or wrong answer, so uh, it's just informational for you. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Thanks for watching.